welcome to GTV. Today we'll be showing you how to disassemble and assemble IDEX X series of e stop push buttons. The X series is made up of three e stop devices from IDEX. The XA e stops are 16 millimeter mounting devices, the XW e stops are 22 millimeter mounting devices, and the XN e stops are 30 millimeter mounting devices. To remove the contact on an XA model, unlock the operator button by turning it clockwise. Then push up on the white bayonet ring. This can be done with a screwdriver, but remember not to use excessive force to protect the switch from damage. While I am exerting pressure on the bayonet ring, I can simply turn my contact block counterclockwise. To mount this device, I will unscrew the locking device. Then place the e-stop in my desired application. I will screw on the locking device to secure the e-stop. Next I will align the arrow on the button with the top marking on the contact block and slide in the contacts and turn the device clockwise until the bayonet ring clicks. To disassemble the XW and XN models, unlock the operator and pull back the bayonet ring until the latch pins click. Then turn the contact block clockwise and pull out. Remove the locking ring and place the e-stop in your desired application. To mount the e-stop device, I will turn the locking ring clockwise until my push button is secure. To install the contact blocks, align the small arrow marking on the edge of the operator with the small arrow marking on the yellow bayonet ring. In some devices, may be indicated by a T on the operator and an S on the bayonet ring. Make sure that you are holding the contact and not the bayonet ring when installing. Then press the contact onto the operator and turn the contact block clockwise until the bayonet ring clicks and locks. IDEX X series of e-stop push buttons along with thousands of other products and services are available at galco.com.